some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Bessemer City, North Carolina, as a uh, frauditor attempts to uh, make claims that uh, he was totally innocent of everything he was doing in there and wonders why the police have showed up to kick him out. But if you were being a good little boy, then why did the cops show up? Because every time I walk into a place for service, the cops don't show up to take me out. But you seem to be a magnet for cops. Gee, I wonder why that is. So at any rate, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Y'all coming for me? Yes, I might call. Okay, can I get the name of the person that called? I said that you were threatening somebody. I was threatening somebody? Yeah, is Diane here? Oh, wow. No. No. Okay. Threatening somebody? Who was I threatening? Can I talk to you? I'd love to know. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. So, what can I help you with over here? I didn't come to ask you guys for nothing. I come here to get what I received and was fixing to walk out the door. Yeah, like all frauditors, you were about to walk out the door. So, let me ask you something, dude. Uh, why did you start this video so late in the uh, audit? Because, well, that's kind of suspicious considering that you were uh, allegedly threatening somebody in there i mean it's rather convenient that you didn't put that part of the video in there of your interaction with everybody in this office before the cops showed up huh interesting sure so yeah i definitely need to know who followed you know called the police and made a false report How's it going? yeah i need a camera Cameras right there. They're on yeah, that one. Right. It's, it's, it's gone. Hmm. I came here to find out if the city manager was here, and she said no, it was over there. Yeah. Was, so I asked for a public record request just to see if they have one. All right. No reason to just right. checking. They give you that piece of paper to fill out. Do what? Did they give you that piece yeah. of paper? Yeah. Oh, good deal. Yeah. No problem. And now the police are calling. It just proves. Uh, it just keeps adding up. That's okay. People digging their own graves. Oh, it keeps on adding up, dude, huh? Uh, yeah, uh, what is it adding up to? Because I would like to know, is it actually going to have any consequences on anybody in this town? Or is it just another one of those empty, frauditor threats that get you absolutely nowhere? I, uh, I ain't doing nothing but try to be curious and kind to everybody and they won't call the police. That's okay. <laughs> hmm. Am I being detained? All right, I'm free to go then. Yeah, Appreciate it. So your name was Tossner? Yes, sir. Okay, yeah, okay. And uh, his name was? That's the deputy. I mean, Henderson. That's Henderson. 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 Okay. All right, and I do need the name of whoever would call it. Had to be one of these two. No idea they call him anonymous. No, nah, they didn't. That's a lie. That's a lie. There's cameras that will tell the truth. Yeah, once we, if we That's, watch the cameras. We'll oh, no, I'm, I'm going to get those cameras. Do what? I said I'm going to request them because I'm being falsely accused of something here, and I know so how it works. Check out, man. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were leaving. I mean, you were heading toward the door, and then all of a sudden you came back here. Are you just trying to, well, uh, escalate the situation or something like that, like you frauditors tend to do? And it still makes me wonder uh, what actually happened prior to the cops showing up because you don't have that on your video. Could you please provide that so we can know what the hell happened? <laughs> <laughs> you know the address here of this building? This is... It's probably on the outside. Yeah. Call the police on me, you guys. 125... Hmm. 
Yeah, it's 125 in Virginia. Yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be East Virginia. Uh, sorry about that. East Virginia. Is it Avenue Street? Yeah, yes, sir. Avenue. Well, for the next few minutes, he just fills the uh, FOIA request form in with the cops still hanging around while they conduct their investigation. So let's go ahead and uh, skip on ahead, shall we? Many, many minutes later. Ma'am, I need to turn my request form in. Thank you so much. I'll pass it on. Appreciate you. Can I get your name? Rinaldi. Rinaldi? Okay. Thank you. Ma'am, can I get your name? Yeah. I'm, I'm, she, does she does have to give her name. Okay, here we go. Here we go. She does. Just like you do, any public official has to give their name. And they do. It is what it is. Yeah, can you provide a citation for that, uh, that every public official has to identify themselves? I mean, uh, inquiring minds actually want to know what statute you're talking about, so please provide a citation. Otherwise, you're just pulling it out of your ass. I mean, there's, there, there's a, see the, the sign on the desk there? Flipped around. There's a reason that sign's there. So the public knows who this is and who they're dealing with. You don't care. And this is what I'm here to expose. That's what you want me to do. I'm not going to make it. Oh, I, 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 her name is what I need. That's, she doesn't want to give it to you. I want and have to. It's two different things. She works for the public. Her name is public record. And I'm just simply asking to a professional courtesy to give me her name. That, that's what's We're the harm? Here, you. here we go. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. So we're not. Why? Well, I mean, like we're I'm asking. You, sir, you've been you've been uh, harassing us all day. And nobody's harassed anybody. Nobody has harassed anybody. <laughs> I have simply come in and asked for public records and complaint forms. How is no, that harassing? Okay. But how is that harassing? Sir, because you feel you, it you're is. You're interfering with their business. I am not interfering with nobody. That is a physical act. Oh yeah, spreading misinformation like that. Interference is only a physical act because, you know, taking attention away from the duties of the officials is interference, such as coming in and screaming at them for no reason or being a uh, jackass and uh, racking up disorderly conduct charges. And I'm not physically interfering with anybody. There's well, you're, no customers you're, in you're here. Tying these people I'm not. I'm, how? By requesting services? What service you request? Oh, well, see, these guys know. They, they, they no, were, I'm asking you. I'm, I'm free to go. Mm -hmm. Free to go? Yeah. You free to go? Yeah. Free to go? Everybody's free to go? Yes, sir. Thank you. Appreciate your service, sir. Yes, sir. Appreciate your. Any retaliation from this point forward, it will be considered, you know, unlawful without any probable cause. Yes, sir. Just giving you a heads up. Wow. Wow. Look, guys, this is what we get here. You see the police back here? Here, getting my tag number just so you can run it. Run it, buddy, run it. Run it! Run it! Y'all just prove. Thank you for proving my point, guys. I appreciate it. And your professional courtesy, sir, I, 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 I appreciate it. I really do. I know you want to do the right thing, but in the end, that's not what counts. It's doing the right thing, period. You know I was here only to request public records. That's it. Please tell me what the police presence is needed for. A lie. Misuse of 
misuse. You have a good day, Mr. Watch what happens. It's, it, it's not going to go unaccounted for, sir. I promise you. If I call the police for no reason, boy, see how they treat us. See how they treat us, guys. See how they treat us. And boy, I tell you. This is exactly why I do what I do, you guys. You see how they treat us? You see how they treat us? Uh, dude, I have never had an encounter with the cops like this in my life. Not one freaking time. But idiots like you seem to do it every single freaking day of your life. I mean, so it's not how they treat us. It's how they treat you because of your behavioral issues. You want to treat everybody around you like garbage so you can get the police involved and, uh, well, berate them, belittle them and everything like that and try to uh, be the big bad man when you are actually a tiny, tiny little man with, with no power and no future. Now he decides to go to the local police department and complain. Uh, so let's go ahead and see how that works out for him. A little longer than a few minutes later. Come here. Watch what happens, you guys. See? Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Denial of service. They just keep adding up, keeps adding up, and keeps adding up. It's, it's not all about you, dumbass. I mean, let's think this thing uh, through logically, shall we? I mean, it appears to be that the sun is quite low in the sky. So could it be that it's uh, sunset at this point? Because I know you wouldn't get up early to uh, go fraud at this place. So could it be that... Uh, the police department shut down for the day. I mean, you also have this uh, particular uh, sign right here on the front of the police station saying for after hours service, call this number. I mean, uh, dude, uh, there's a lot of things to consider here. Not just the, uh, oh, they're trying to deny me service. No, at least call this number because you never know. The reason why you didn't get service right at that particular point was because they were closed. But I guess that didn't uh, compute with your tiny little brain. But at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?